Exponential Smoothing, Wikipedia Audio Exponential smoothing is a rule of thumb technique for smoothing time series data using the exponential window function. Whereas in the simple moving average the past observations are weighted equally, exponential functions are used to assign exponentially decreasing weights over time. It is an easily learned and easily applied procedure for making some determination based on prior assumptions by the user, such as seasonality. Exponential smoothing is often used for analysis of time series data. Exponential smoothing is one of many window functions commonly applied to smooth data in signal processing, acting as low-pass filters to remove high-frequency noise. This method is preceded by Poisson's use of recursive exponential window functions in convolutions from the 19th century, as well as Kolmogorov and Zerbenko's use of recursive moving averages from their studies of turbulence in the 1940s. The raw data sequence is often represented by x, t, backslash, beginning at time, t, equals, zero and the output of the exponential smoothing algorithm is commonly written as s t backslash which may be regarded as a best estimate of what the next value of x will be when the sequence of observations begins at time t equals 0 the simplest form of exponential smoothing is given by the formulas background S zero equals X zero S T equals alpha X T plus one alpha S T one T zero S and equals X backslash backslash S and equals backslash alpha X plus S backslash T zero backslash end where alpha is the smoothing factor and 0 0 based on the raw data up to time t double exponential smoothing is given by the formulas and for t2 by where alpha is the data smoothing factor 0 1 notes note that f0 is undefined and according to the definition F1 equals S0 plus B0, which is well defined, thus further values can be evaluated. A second method, referred to as either Brown's linear exponential smoothing or Brown's double exponential smoothing works as follows. Where AT, the estimated level at time T and BT, the estimated trend at time T are. Triple exponential smoothing applies exponential smoothing three times, which is commonly used when there are three high-frequency signals to be removed from a time series under study. There are different types of seasonality, multiplicative and additive in nature, much like addition and multiplication are basic operations in mathematics. If every month of December we sell 10,000 more apartments than we do in November the seasonality is additive in nature. However, if we sell 10% more apartments in the summer months than we do in the winter months the seasonality is multiplicative in nature. Multiplicative seasonality can be represented as a constant factor, not an absolute amount. Triple exponential smoothing was first suggested by Holt's student, Peter Winters, in 1960 after reading a signal processing book from the 1940s on exponential smoothing. Holt's novel idea was to repeat filtering an odd number of times greater than 1 and less than 5, which was popular with scholars of previous eras. While recursive filtering had been used previously, it was applied twice and four times to coincide with the Hadamard conjecture, while triple application required more than double the operations of singular convolution. 
The use of a triple application is considered a rule of thumb technique, rather than one based on theoretical foundations and has often been overemphasized by practitioners. Suppose we have a sequence of observations, beginning at time t equals zero with a cycle of seasonal change of length l. The method calculates a trend line for the data as well as seasonal indices that weight the values in the trend line based on where that time point falls in the cycle of length L. Represents the smoothed value of the constant part for time T represents the sequence of best estimates of the linear trend that are superimposed on the seasonal changes. Is the sequence of seasonal correction factors. CT is the expected proportion of the predicted trend at any time T mod L in the cycle that the observations take on. As a rule of thumb, a minimum of two full seasons of historical data is needed to initialize a set of seasonal factors. The output of the algorithm is again written as FT and M, an estimate of the value of X at time T and M. M0 based on the raw data up to time t. Triple exponential smoothing with multiplicative seasonality is given by the formulas. Where alpha is the data smoothing factor, 0. The general formula for the initial trend estimate B0 is. Setting the initial estimates for the seasonal indices Ci for i equals 1, 2, L is a bit more involved. If n is the number of complete cycles present in your data, then where? Note that aj is the average value of x in the jth cycle of your data. Triple exponential smoothing with additive seasonality is given by s, 0, equals, x, 0, s, t, equals, alpha, x, t, c, t, l, plus, 1, alpha, s, t, 1, plus, b, t, 1, b, t, equals, beta, s, t, s, t, 1, plus, 1, beta, b, t, 1, c, t, equals gamma x t s t 1 b t 1 plus 1 gamma c t l f t plus m equals s t plus m b t plus c t l plus 1 plus m 1 mod l s and equals x backslash backslash s and equals backslash alpha plus backslash backslash b and equals backslash beta plus b backslash backslash c and equals backslash gamma plus c backslash backslash f and equals s plus mb plus c backslash end